In the world of power plugs, there are two main types, those with two prongs and those with three. However, something you might have noticed is that some laptop chargers have swappable ends which extend the cord but also add a third prong. If the third prong isn't necessary on the shorter cable, why is it on the longer one? First, it is important to understand what this third prong is for. It should come as no surprise that were you to touch an exposed wire, you'd get an electric shock. This happens because the electrical current finds a new way to return to the ground, through you. However, the third prong ensures that were this to happen, the current goes through the third prong instead. This creates a short circuit which will immediately trip the breaker, shutting off power to the device. Why is this only a feature on the longer cable then? Well, if you look closely, you might notice it's not just one big cable, there's a big brick in the middle. This is a transformer which turns the high voltage power straight from the outlet into the lower voltage power your device can use to charge safely. Even if there were an exposed wire on the other side of the brick, touching it would give a slightly painful but essentially safe shock. It's the difference between being hit with a trickle of water from a tap versus a high pressure hose. The additional safety element of the third prong simply isn't necessary on the low voltage side of the transformer.